New tonight, doctors at area clinics say they're seeing an increase of people suffering from seasonal allergies. They're definitely not fun. NBC 26's Valerie Juarez tells us what doctors are saying and how you can alleviate the symptoms. It's officially allergy season, and as the weather warms up and the winds pick up, that pollen in the air will soon have you ready to scratch your eyes out. So after having a quiet winter when there really aren't a lot of allergens around, you know, the sudden increase in the tree pollen makes people take notice. Dr. Karen Kahn's with Allergy and Asthma Associates in Appleton says she's been having a lot more people come into her office and complain about allergies. After a long winter, she says this is the time that trees are pollinating and therefore inducing your seasonal allergies. And then the next wave of pollens to pollinate would be grass in the summer and then ragweed and weeds in the late summer and early fall. However, for another doctor in the Fox Valley, he says you can expect to continue to grab those tissues, as this year we're expecting a higher pollen season. Part of that is because we've had an increase in temperature, there's more climate changes, there's more wind. When we have more wind, then we have more pollen, and those are days that you need to be a little more cautious with your allergies. For relief, doctors recommend being ahead of the game and say that if you know that you tend to get bad seasonal allergies, take antihistamine tablets. Nasal sprays are also a good option to have on hand. Nasal sprays are also a good option to have on hand. And if none of these things work, they say that's when you should see a doctor. In Appleton, Valerie Juarez, NBC 26. Valerie, thank you.